Um, so this is a new video update, and I'm very uh, happy that we have Mr. Zach Kreger here, who uh, played Jeff in the movie. So, so Zach, what have you been up to? Um, I have not been doing as much as I'd like to have been doing. I'd like this movie to hurry up and come out. Um, <laughs> that's why this Kickstarter is so important to me. Yes, yes um, it is. Yes, it is. I did a I did a sitcom on NBC. Um, I've been writing a lot. I've been touring with the whitest kids you know, my old oh, sketch yeah. group. We've been writing a movie uh, for for the for the whitest kids. Um, so one other thing that I want to include in this in this clip is uh, is a a new little blooper that came from the set um, of this fun little moment between you and uh, the character who played Pocahontas, Jesse Tilton. Mm -hmm. So tell, tell us a little bit about that, that blooper. Um, yeah, we're in the lobby of the Alamo Draft House, and I am yeah. trying to seduce slash just convince these girls to hang out with us later in the yeah. night. Um, obviously, my mind is in a dirty place. And uh, Brian, you let me kind of just take a couple of takes for myself, and, uh, yeah. and which we did all throughout the movie, which was so fun. Yeah. And, uh, and uh, yeah, the clip is uh, a bunch of those together. Yes. Okay, let me ask you another question. Um, what are you guys doing later on? Because we have like two cases of beer, and I thought we'd just get together and figure it out. Um, no. Do I have something on my face? No, no. You're just, you're beautiful. <laughs> now, and are you part Native American? Because I just sense this inner dignity. And are you part Indian? Because you have the cheekbones of the Sioux. I is it true that your people have uh, strong oral traditions? Wow. I gotta say, like, I, I think Native Americans are gorgeous, but you make that Land O'Lakes girl look like a big pile of barf. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm talking about? You like butter? <laughs> <laughs> so, so the way that it works, you know, like we have these levels of perks and, the, and, the, and the, we have the various actor packs. Um, somebody already snapped one of these Zach packs, uh, which is, yeah. Um, is that true? Yeah, yeah, totally. So it's, well, we talked about a couple other things. I don't know. It, I don't know. There's one thing that I that I thought of that I just kind of wanted to run by you. So, um, so I'm gonna offer up myself as a uh, filmmaker consultant. So this this one is sort of designed for filmmakers out there. Um, so I'm gonna like offer myself up as somebody who will come to the set of your movie. I'll read your script beforehand. I'll give you notes. You're going to go to set and, and help yeah, somebody. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, but, I mean, would you be, would you be willing to do that? I mean, this would be like a high dollar thing. How high dollar are we talking about here, Brian? Well, I mean, the top, the top one that we have right now is is three thousand dollars. That's like the, uh, the, the, like the my own private roadshow. So I think it would probably be. I mean, this is a premium. You know, you're, you're, you're a well known guy. You directed a feature film. You. Start that that was very poorly received, very poorly received. We're gonna cut that part out. <laughs> you just said that, but then but then you also had a TV show on IFC for like what five years. So, yeah, you know you're legit. So I mean, I think uh, but then but like, then what if they're shooting it in Alaska? I have to go to Alaska. I love. I would love to go to Alaska. But yeah, no, we, we'll we'll fly you there. Like that's part of the deal. So that's okay. why it's got to be kind of expensive. So I don't know. I was thinking maybe like I don't know like. Four thousand dollars. So like a little. I was thinking like fifty nine seventy five, fifty nine thousand. I, mean, I would, I would, do, I would do it for what do we say? You say four, I say seven. Seven. Um. Huh. So what if? I mean, what if we did like? What if we did like five thousand? I could do that. Really? So I go for a day. I hang out on set and yeah. I offer whatever advice you, I have. You, you read the script before, or at least say that right. you did. You know, uh, I'd be prepared. Okay, and then you do a little consultation with them beforehand. You know, over Skype like this, and then you go to wherever the set is. You know, and we'll do it within the U.S. Unless it's okay. some place, unless it's like you know the Maldives, like some place you want to go to. Yeah, I'm prepared to go outside of the U.S. I like to travel. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, that sounds fun. Yes, I would. I will do that. Most of my advice is going to be based around the craft service table, though. I'm just <laughs> service closer. Yeah, exactly. I'm not um, going to have a lot of ideas about narrative or structure yeah, or lighting. Yeah, yeah. We have one more thing that we would like you to do, um, and that is to read off the list of donors, of some new donors that donated to the campaign. So if you can find them yes. email, 
Um, I will do that right now. Ready? All righty. Yes. I want to thank the following people. Kinky Town. That's a good one. Skim Milf. Okay, for the healthy people. Cold Mountain. A little literary name there. Cold Mountain. No G. Uh, floppy Dicks. We go straight from the high class to the Floppy Dicks. Thank you, nonetheless. Floppy Dicks. I was, I was proud of that one. <laughs> did you write? Did you come I, up with I've that? come up with all of these so far. Oh, okay, all right. I am a sick live man. action live action pole player. Uh huh. Yeah. Reach around, <laughs> reach around, Sue. I don't know why that one got me, but that's a good one. I love it. Reach around, Sue, and Mighty Joe hung. <laughs> Mighty Joe hung. Very nice. Thank you, everybody. Thanks. Sincerely. Thank you, yeah. guys, and thank you so much, Zach, for uh, for being willing to uh, to visit with us.